Hey everyone, welcome back and thanks for tuning in. I'm Jason Worley with WC Fab. If you've been following along our channel, you'll see we uh, recently did a video on our 2024 GMC Denali shop truck. Uh, just doing a little build series to show you guys the upgrades and all of the uh, supporting brands that we work with and sell here and install at WC Fab. We covered uh, all of our chassis, suspension, and exterior upgrades. And episode two here is about all of the underhood products. So as you can imagine, on a WC Fab shop truck, it's got the whole WC Fab catalog installed under the hood. So we'll go through piece by piece here. Obviously, we have a lot of product videos individually. If you have interest in one item in particular, uh, be sure to check out our channel and, and see those separate videos where we go into more detail on each product individually. So starting over on the driver's side, uh, upgraded coolant tank both the main coolant tank and the small auxiliary coolant tank. The auxiliary tank being a new product that we released uh, within the last six months or so. Both of these upgrades are a nice, aesthetically pleasing uh, component under the hood that replaces uh, factory plastic pieces. Every fitting and component on our tanks, all machined here in-house. And then of course, powder coating as well. So we've got nice heavy duty tanks made out of heavy wall, aluminum, they mount in the factory locations using all of the factory mounting points so that they're rigid. They come standard with the billet aluminum black anodized caps. If you'd like to opt for clear anodized, we do offer those available separately on the website as well. Moving across the engine bay from the coolant tanks, we have our upper coolant pipe assembly as well as our powder coated thermostat housing neck. So the powder coated coolant pipe, uh, fabricated aluminum coolant pipe is uh, an upgraded component over the factory hose. Again, just another aesthetically pleasing component. If you're trying to accent your engine bay and trying to add a little more color or do a custom build with a certain theme or color scheme. Next, we've got our three inch high flow aluminum mandrel bent driver side intercooler pipe. One big feature of our intercooler pipe versus the factory one is the fact that the factory intercooler pipe is mostly a large chunk of rubber. About half of the pipe is just a big long rubber boot. So we eliminate that, we get rid of this big long rubber boot that the factory uses, and it's a nice three inch diameter, 14 gauge aluminum mandrel bent pipe from the turbocharger all the way down to the intercooler, supplied with two new high quality silicone boots. Moving on from the hot side pipe, we also offer our high flow three and a half inch cold side intercooler pipe. This is replacing the factory plastic component. We have a CNC machined flange at the bottom of the intercooler pipe that uses two O-rings to seal to the intercooler, as well as a new supplied retaining clip where the factory intercooler pipe is just a single lip ring style seal, which under higher boost applications, those lip rings can be notorious for leaks. So we use a double O-ring seal there for a more positive fitment and less chance of boost leaks. Get rid of the factory plastic three and a quarter inch pipe for a larger diameter of three and a half inch. Uh, again, mandrel bent 14 gauge aluminum. And then that connects to the Y-bridge at the throttle valve. We supply a new build aluminum adapter uh, as part of the cold side kit, which slides over the factory throttle valve connection and includes a new retaining ring. And we supply a new silicone boot to connect that billet aluminum adapter to our aluminum intercooler pipe. Both intercooler pipes are available as a bolt-on upgrade. These do not require tuning. They don't require any modifications. They are a direct OEM replacement upgrade over the factory parts. On top of the engine, first and foremost, you can see it. A very large component is our high flow four inch intake system with our high flow three and a half inch intake horn. So this truck actually has our new high flow four inch cast aluminum intake horn. We developed the high flow intake horn for the L5P way back in 2016 when we first bought our 2017 L5P. And we've been making and selling that horn for many years. It's a, it's a great upgrade for L5P owners, especially if you have performance tuning or upgraded turbochargers. And over the last uh, year or so, we uh, went back to the drawing board and actually made the part even better. Uh, we made it larger and we made it flow even more than the old style horn. And it's manufactured from cast aluminum versus uh, fabricated uh, steel. 
So that horn is actually a four inch inlet and it, it carries a four inch diameter much further than our old style horn, which was four inch inlet that reduced to three and a half right away and then went down to the flange. Uh, the new style cast part opened up a lot of opportunities going to the casting versus a fabricated steel part and we're able to hold a larger diameter and get better flow out of that part and a much smoother transition down to that turbocharger. So be sure to uh, stay tuned. We'll have uh, some videos here in the near future talking about that new style uh, air intake horn for the L5P. Uh, that connects to our four inch high flow intake, as I mentioned, a nice, uh, large fabricated air box that sits right in the factory location with a high flow four inch air filter and outerwear's cover. These components are available separately if you want to do them piece by piece, or you can buy our whole bundle packages offered in stage one, which is both intercooler pipes, stage two, which is both intercooler pipes, the intake system and intake horn, and then stage three, which is all of those components, plus the addition of our high flow three and a half inch mandrel bent turbo down pipe. Uh, last but not least on this truck, we've got our billet high flow exhaust manifolds and our two inch stainless steel turbo up pipes. So that is a very nice kit. It's uh, replacing all of the factory cast components for a much nicer, smoother flowing billet style manifold that we manufacture here in house. They're CNC machined halves that we weld together. And then those connect to our high flow two inch stainless steel up pipes. The factory up pipes on the L5P, they're about inch and three quarters diameter and they're a very thin wall, 16 gauge material. If you have any performance upgrades on your truck, like turbochargers or tuning, uh, the up pipes on the Duramaxes are one of the most common failure points when you do those types of performance upgrades because the factory up pipes just leave a lot of room uh, for improvement. They've got a lot of crushed areas in them. They're a small diameter. They're a very weak bellow. And we address all those areas with our high flow two inch stainless steel up pipes. Also bolted together with our ARP hardware kits. So that wraps up our underhood upgrades on our 2024 GMC Denali. Um, waiting for calibrated power to finish their stealth turbo options for these trucks since the turbochargers uh, got a little bit of an upgrade from GM in the 2024 model year. So once we have uh, turbocharging and tuning available for these 24s, we'll be sure to have that product installed next. If you've got any questions on any of these parts, or would like to learn a little bit more about an individual component, as I mentioned earlier, we do have separate videos on each part separately. If you've got any questions, feel free to leave a comment below or reach out to our sales team and we'll be happy to help. Thanks a lot for watching.